Compounding is the process in which two lexemes are taken together. Two lexemes. Now try to understand what a lexeme is. This is the process of bringing two equals together, two dictionary words together, two bases together, two lexemes together. Air and port combine together to form a new word called airport. We have a word bus and we have a word stand. So we combine them together to form the word bus stand. We have a word news and we have the word paper. We combine them to form newspaper and so on and so forth. There are plenty of examples by means of which we try to derive new words by combining two free morphemes together. Compounding is the process that can be systematically understood. How systematically understood? Because we have different types of compound words. I mean different word classes combined together to form new compound words. The first such, you can see it in your slide also, the first such is preposition noun compound. One preposition combines with a noun to form a new word. See the examples, you can read them on, on your slide also. Overdose, underdog, afterthought, uptown, override, overtake, beforehand, etc. Over is a preposition, dose is a noun. Underdog, under is a preposition, dog is a noun. After is a preposition, thought is a noun. So this is the same thing, preposition noun compounding. A verb noun compounding in which verb combines with a noun. One verb, we take one verb and then we take one noun and we take them together to form a compound word. For example, swear word, rattlesnake, wet stone, scrub woman. These are the examples you can see on your screen also. These are the examples of verb noun compounds. Swear, I swear. Swear, you say, I swear. Swear is a verb and word is a noun. So that becomes swear word. That is um, verb noun compound and the process is called verb noun compounding. See the third type, noun adjective compound. When noun combines with an adjective or when noun compounds with an adjective, it's called noun object adjective compound. And the examples are given in your slide. Head is a noun. Strong is an adjective. So noun adjective compound. Honey sweet. Honey is a noun. Sweet is an adjective. Skin is a noun. Deep is an adjective. Nation is a noun. Wide is an adjective. So all these are noun adjective compounds. The next is adjective adjective compound. See two adjectives combined together. Red hot. Worldly wise. Widespread. Red is, a, red is an adjective. Hot is also adjective. Worldly is an adjective. Wise is also an adjective. Wide is an adjective. Spread is also an adjective. So these are the examples of adjective, adjective compounds. And the process is called adjective, adjective compounding process. Preposition, adjective compounding also there. Wherein preposition compounds or combines together with an adjective to form the new word. For example, overabundant, underripe. Preposition, adjective, compound. Over, preposition, abundant, adjective, under, preposition, ripe, adjective, under, preposition, privileged, adjective. So this is called adjective, adjective, compounding process. Noun, verb, compounding. In which noun compounds with the verb. See the examples on your screen. Color, code, break breast feed chain smoke pan fry handmade etc breast is a noun feed is a verb color is a no color is a noun code is a verb chain is a noun smoke is a verb pan is a noun fry is a verb so this is called noun verb compounding adjective verb compounds now let's talk about adjective verb compounds in which an adjective compounds with the verb adjective comes initially and verb comes later and that is called adjective verb compounding see the examples in which adjectives compound with the verb sharp is an adjective shoot is a verb so sharp shoot becomes adjective verb compound dry is an Adjective clean is a verb, so it becomes adjective verb compound dry clean. White is an adjective, wash is a verb, so adjective verb compound is whitewash.
And there is another process which is miscellaneous, in fact, in which multiple words compound together with other words. For example, newspaper boy. Newspaper and boy, three independent morphemes combined together to form the word newspaper boy. Dry clean machine. Dry clean is already, uh, already we've seen and we add machine to it. So that becomes another compound, a lengthy process of compounding that is called multiple word compounds. You can compound two, three, four words together. This process is called multiple words compounding. Okay. For example, honey sweet juice. That means juice which is sweet like honey. Honey sweet juice or dry clean machine. Machine that cleans in dry phase. That is called dry clean machine. So it's like that. So this was about the process of compounding.